What is up guys, welcome back to Random Round Playthroughs, let's play Ratchet and Clank. Remember in the last episode, we met Skid McMarks and Skid's agent, both at separate times, and we found out we need a swing shot to be able to traverse through Planet Iridia any further, so let's, without anything else left to do here, we're gonna head to Planet Kerwan. So, remember Captain Quark was here, shooting a commercial for Al's RoboShack, so maybe if we find Al's RoboShack, we can find Captain Quark and... Help him stop Chairman Drek. So, let's go. Yep, yeah. 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 So yeah, every time you fly to a different planet, you get this little cutscene, or a variation of it. It's always two different flight patterns, and then you always end up flying like that into the planet. So, yeah. It's cool, though. This is a great planet. So yeah, I, a lot of people really like this planet because it has a lot of great features. So you, right off the bat, you can start by breaking these. Basically, everything in this planet is breakable. And right off the bat, you can see there's a Gadgetron vendor. So what are we going to do? We are going to buy a new weapon. I, I mentioned this in the last episode, the blaster. It's a great weapon. It's basically used for the remainder of the game. It's great, and let's check out the animation. Sweet! Yes, this gun is amazing. So, let's break these. Break that. Break these. Break everything. The blaster is amazing for many, many reasons. Break those boxes. Mostly because of its auto-targeting, and it just, it's just fantastic. That. Alright, let's head over here. Remember, we gotta find a swing shot on this plane. <gasps> Look at that! Oh. Captain Quark, you alright, buddy? Welcome to the Captain Quark Fitness Course. If you're strong enough, fast enough, and clever enough to beat my fitness challenge, you will receive a reward from my head trainer. Simply make your way to the third island to complete the course. Good luck. Quark Enterprises is not responsible for sprains, broken bones, snapped tendons, bruised egos, or accidental death incurred while taking the challenge. Well, Excuse me, Captain, but we have more pressing issues. We urgently need your assistance. Clank? Yes? Do you notice anything unusual about Captain Quark? Well, I find the fact that he has a spring where his leg should be to be quite puzzling. And why do you think that is? Possibly an injury incurred while battling evil? This isn't the real Captain Quark, you numbskull. It's a robot. Oh. <laughs> I love that cutscene. Poor Clank is like, oh. Like, you would think a robot of, like, himself would be able to identify his own kind. Do you not have scanners or something for that? Oh, poor Clank. Alright, so yeah, as you heard the robot quirk say, we have to complete the obstacle course to get a prize from his head trainer. And his head trainer is a piece of work. Let me just tell you that. And this uh, obstacle course actually provides some level of difficulty. So you gotta do wall jumps. And I like to go back over this away. Excuse me, Ratchet. Break these boxes. Just because I have to have every piece of money I can find. This is gonna hurt us. Damn it, there's nothing I could do with that. Now we have more wall jumps. The first area is not too, too difficult, as that's basically all it was you just saw there. Break these last two boxes. And I'm sure you've seen what this is. You're wondering what is that and where does it go? Well, it goes all the way down there. And how do we do it? We stand under here and we jump. So it's essentially we use our wrench as a makeshift zip line. So let's head around here, make sure that we're not missing anything. We might be. Uh huh. There's a couple of straight bolts, as there usually are. Now I can never remember how to get over there, because that's one of my favorite areas. Look at all the boxes. There's much more that cannot be seen, but for now let's just finish the obstacle course. This is where it starts to get a little difficult, but not impossible. 
as you can see, this slides, so you have a limited amount of time. And you also have to time your jumps well. So, let's try that again. Jump on that. Try it again. Okay, so both of these move at the same time, so have even less time. Jump there. And up here. Excuse me, Ratchet. And we can jump over here. Jump over to this one now, and over here. Now the now this one's tricky because the moving walls now actually f are what we have to... No, shit! My m greed for money almost got us killed there. Holy oh, crap, I just hit my mic, and my mic just came off. One second. Yikes, sorry about that. I just hit my mic trying to stop myself from falling off my chair. Now luckily that platform we're on itself does not actually move. But we have a limited time with these! Fuck. Be right back. Okay, we're back. Let's try that again. That was me being really dumb. There we go. That's better. That's never happened to me before. So, that's area two of the obstacle course. A little bit tricky. If you can do it right. Yeah, oh, we lost some health. Oh yeah, with the boxes. So let's jump! Oh god. And go see this piece of crap fitness trainer. Just look at her. Listen up, you lard balls! That was the most pathetic display I have ever seen on that obstacle course! What do you mean? We finished the circuit, ma'am. Oh yeah, but it is weak. Weak, weak! When I was competing, I would devour courses like that for breakfast! <laughs> Bet that's not all. If it were up to me, you would drill, drill, drill for the rest of the day! But somehow you managed to impress that fool Captain Quark! Captain Quark knows about us? He certainly does. And worst of all, he wants me to give you a prize for that ridiculous performance! Cool, what is it? I'm supposed to give you a swing shot! So you can sway to and fro like little insects. All right, let's see it. Not so fast. Today, the two of you disgraced my obstacle course, so I am going to make you pay. But that prize is ours from the captain. That's not fair. Too bad, life's not fair. Ugh, what did I tell you? What a piece of work. So fat, she probably never competed a day in her life at anything besides eating contests. Captain Quark knows about us, which is a huge thing, especially for Clank. Let's just beat her up a little bit. And we're supposed to get a swing shot from Captain, and she's going to bribe us for it. So, we have no choice but to buy it for 1,000 bolts. Sweet! I bet Captain Quark uses stuff like this all the time. Ha! Real men can swing without silly toys like that! The two of you make me sick! Ugh, what a bitch. Alright, so we now have a swing shot, so let's give it a try. Wacha! It's fantastic to use. I love using the swing shot. Just a second, sorry. Alright, so we use it. The green ones are automatic zips, and the yellow ones are swings. Alright, so I like go on purpose. Just so you can get a bit of a demonstration as just to how far these things can go. I'm pretty sure I can hit it from here. Definitely hit this one. Gotcha! Okay, so that's prob- Let me just check the time on this. No, we got a little bit of time left. We got enough time. Alright, so let's jump down here. Excuse me. Alright, so we now have the swing shot. So, that's cool. Let's quit the blaster right quick. Right quick. Wow. So let's head back out. Let's talk to Captain Quarkbot again, see if there's anything we should say. Excuse me, I want to talk to you. You're not going to say anything now? Fine, screw you. I want to talk to you anyway. I was bluffing. So now, the only other way we can go is this way. To quickly center the and camera. this, she's just, just gonna tell us, but 
Yeah, see, this is why I love the blaster so much. It'll lock on from a fair, di from a pretty far distance, and you can automatically hit them. You're, there's only one gun that does that better, and we get it. We get it way later in the game. It's, it's a, they're both great guns, but the blaster is just fantastic. My favorite weapon, though, is probably the super equivalent of the blaster, which you will know later. The reason I keep getting so much money is because I want a certain weapon that costs a shit. Once you find, once we get to the point where you where it first becomes available, you will see what I'm talking about. But for now, we have the blaster, and let's make our way down here. See what? Come here. Excuse me. This has never been this difficult. Sorry, I went quiet. No, get back here. Blown right up. All right, we have a few bolts to pick up. I want to go in there, but I don't think I can. See the Metropolis sound, like song theme, is what I was looking for. It's pretty good. Excuse me. I gotta tell you guys, I'm loving having a capture card. Right now. It's fantastic. Like, I love recording videos, but this is just a whole new level of amazing. Like, this is just fantastic. Whoa, 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 whoa. what's that one worth? I don't look like it was worth 10. I didn't know there was 10 in here. Huh, cool. Okay, so get the blaster out. Excuse me, why are you not hitting? That hit detection. Oh shit! No you don't, get back here! Damn it, he got away. Oh well. <laughs> oh well. We'll break the rest of the stuff up here. Okay, okay. Turn here, get up to like 5600. No, not quite. Wow, I overestimated quite a bit. They're just littering the field with blaster ammo, and I'm not even picking all of it up. Why am I not picking it all up? <laughs> okay, so. Before we head down these escalators, this has been Random Round Playthroughs. If you enjoyed it, wait. Yeah, this has been Random Round Playthroughs. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and a comment. As well, subscribe subscribe for more videos like this one. Don't forget to check out my Twitter and Facebook pages, as well as my Twitch TV and Livestream.com channels. Links are all in the description below. So, until next time, guys. I am signing off.